Hello chat, it's me from the beyond. Are you ready for this shit? Are you ready for this shit? Cause I'm ready for this shit. Hello and welcome every single goddamn one of you. Welcome to the stream. We're gonna do some mildly entertaining things today. It may or may not be a blast, but we'll see how things go. As promised, we're gonna finish Gata Roboto, because we started it, and I think we're at the end. Uh, and we quit, because we're a baby, right before the end. So we're gonna go finish that today. And then, we're gonna start what we unlocked with our community challenge. That glorious torch-only run of Bloodborne. We're just gonna get right into Gato Roboto so we can just knock it out. And then, uh, yeah, we'll uh, set up the old PlayStation and get that Bloodborne run going. So let's play some cat games. Yeah, I mean, if we're if we're eighty percent done with the game, I think. I have no memory of what we were doing. What were we doing? We were going this way. We were going this way. Oh god, controls! I have no memory of how to play. But this will be fine. We lost like, oh, we got to go through all of this again. I remember I got upset because <laughs> we had to do all this backtracking. And backtracking we will do. Go away, go away, go. Oh my God. Okay. Get out of here, you squids. I'm not afraid to murder. No, I don't want to get in the sub. I want to run on my little cute cat style treadmill. All right, Kiki. Let's go, Kiki. We've got murders to accomplish. And then we come here. Oh no! <laughs> the squid! God damn you, squid! Oh my god, we gotta backtrack. We gotta backtrack so far. All of that work was for nothing. Why, Kiki? Why must the good suffer? You cute cat, son of a bitch. Stop going back in your cute little submarine, cat. We got places to be. We got to backtrack again because we keep dying.
Oh my god. The cat controls are so fluttery. We just gotta not fuck up our jump there. <laughs> Let's just not die this time. Okay, we kill all the enemies. We get our suit back. Everything is as it should be in the world. Hmm. Because we can get up here. And then... We should just be able to jump! Like any good mech cat can do. Attention, non-humanoid visitor of research facility. Cat. Meow. You should be aware, before continuing below, the return function has been disabled for this elevator. Your safety is not guaranteed. This is, in other words, a point of no return. As in, the, if there is a human controlling you, and they wish to return to a previous point, and collect inconsequential artifacts from around the world, in order to satiate their desire to fear or a hundred percent then they might want to turn back now well said i will miss hearing that proceed with caution okay well i guess we go the other way first oh son of a bitch I guess we can save here too, right? Oh no, it auto saves, doesn't it? Okay. Yes, let's let's get the checkpoint here and let's just see what this other side has to offer. Oh my god, how much energy does that thing have? Was that it? It was just the frog? Oh no. It's a long level with multiple frogs. My one nightmare, multiple frogs. Oh my God, why do you run so far? I'm 
I'm gonna die to this thing, my god. Woo, we did it! Lore! Security, facility log, 2309. This is Jimbo, breach protocol. Oh. We already read this one. Oh, my lord. I guess that's a shortcut anyway. It's a speedrun strat. Alright, let's go beat the game. Kiki means business. Kiki's gonna commit war crimes. Let's go! All the more frogs to murder. Your drones and frogs cannot stop Kiki. Oh, I did not notice that frog. <laughs> Foolish frogs. Oh, fuck. I was not paying attention to the wall. Am I done with murder elevator? Have we conquered the murder elevator? Oh, crushy things. I don't have to pay attention. I can just speed run it. We're going at 10,000 cat speed. Oh, that was an enemy. What's your stick? What do you do? Okay, that was <laughs> not a very fun uh, mini encounter there. Oh god, I'm getting clapped. We're going lightning cat speed through all this shit. I don't know what you is. Yeah, that upgrade to make the gun auto fire is actually a lot stronger than I thought it was. 
I thought it was pretty nice just because it saves your finger from being hurt. But yeah, a lot of the enemies just will get infinitely staggered from it. There we go. That's the good old jump. Oh no! The game is putting up walls. Oh, I actually have to fight. Oh, I'm taking damage. Just die! Just die, you robot! Oh my god. <laughs> this guy's just falcon punching me. Do I have more enemies? Of oh, you're an enemy, yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna just gonna kill this guy nice and cheesy. Just as the devs intended, I'm sure. Mm. Nope, can't use that. How do we how do we do this? Do I have to just cross the whole room? Okay, hold on. Try that again. Beautiful, but I only got- Oh no, there's- there's the one HP I had. Oh, rip. Which way do we go? We go down. We gotta do a better job of not getting absolutely clapped by the enemies in that room. I mean, ideally, we don't get clapped by any enemies, regardless of room. You're going to let me through. All right, we need to kill you. Come on. Come on! Get hit by the rocket! No! Why aren't you dead? There we go. 
dead robots. Oh my god. I actually am really upset I got baited by that. Yep, just me totally being fair, fighting these robots fair and square, not stunlocking them or anything like that. Let me get this one too. Now we gotta do our sick jump strat. Why are you just out of my reach? Stop that. Oh, we can just walk right past you. We'll stunlock the big guy, and then this little propeller one ain't so bad. Okay, or he can just absolutely ultra instinct all of our shots. Oh, a save, thank god. We don't have to do that anymore. We don't have to ever do that again. Are we done? Are we at the end? Can I fight the boss? Is that my friend? You rat bastard! Well, 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 if it isn't my feline foe. Meow! Don't be smug. I have you exactly where I want you. Or, haven't you realized? All of these challenges you have been through, all of the adversity you have overcome, those were but a series of experiments to see if you'd make a viable vessel. And you've proven to be very strong and very resilient. You will make the perfect host for my poor dying dog, Barkley. No! The scientist was the mouse! The twist we all saw coming! He's sick, you see, and has been for a long time. I've been preserving his life in a hydroglobular tube, but I knew sooner or later that wouldn't be enough. It wouldn't be enough. It wouldn't be enough! So I accessed the military database and found you and Gary. Both suitable hosts for me and for Barkley. Won't be laughing now, will you? When I have the body of a soldier and the mind of someone who has killed so many people. So many. Imagine my delight when I discovered that Gary's patrol route was in the sector. I repaired the galactic broadcaster and sent out a security alert. And then, you imbeciles crashed your ship right into my backyard. Leave it to a dimwit soldier to pin himself inside his own ship. Luckily his body wasn't damaged too much. Now I'm going to transfer my consciousness into Gary's body. And finally rid of this pathetic form. Then I'm going to do the same for Barkley with you. Everyone is going to regret degrading me. And treating me like a filthy rat. Why am I doing this, you ask? I can't even remember anymore. Okay, a solid reason, not remembering. Oh, he's straight up Dr. Eggmaning it. Damn, I actually got hit. God, he's tanky. Oh my god, he's so fast! Woo!
<laughs> just slightly donk him on the dome. Oh my god. Oh, hold on. Let's just get back to our rhythm. We had it and we got a little greedy. Oh, I don't know this move. Oh, it's a stomper pad. I mean, I don't think we can really hit him here. Give me back my human's body, you rat bastard. And your Dr. Eggman domes. Boom. Easy peasy. And honestly, easier than some of the other bosses we've been fighting. There you are, Kiki. Well, see that tube above? That's where you'll go for your final rest. Tired yet? You think you've beaten me? Ha! Like I even need a mech. Are you, are you just gonna... Are you just gonna fist fight me? I'm in a mech, dude. With this sweet physique and opposable thumbs, I'll take you out the old-fashioned way. Say hello to my latest minigun. Meow! Might as well say goodbye too while you're at it. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, he's actually good. Oh, fuck. This is the body of a true soldier. Um, I don't know why I'm bouncing around so much. Oh, it's a scripted defeat. This is it, cat. You have no choice but to surrender. Your vessel has been damaged enough. Alert! Disturbance detected. Computer, don't interrupt me. The situation is under control. Enter passcode to release hydroglobular tubes. Enough! Your assistance is not required here. Incorrect. Please enter passcode. The passcode is meow. Meow! Correct! Releasing hydroglobular tubes. Is the dog gonna fight back? B B Barkley! You need to stay in the tube. Your condition is unstable. And then bork and noises intensify. Barkley, why? Do you not recognize me? It's me. Bark, bark, bark. It's Otto, your friend. Bark, bark, bark. Your master! Woof. Gah! Woof, woof. Cats and dogs respecting each other. <laughs> it's a full ass conversation. Am I just going to leave my human behind? I'm gonna beat you there! Or I'm not.
Mission complete. We left the human behind? <laughs> I feel bad that we left the human behind. He didn't do anything wrong. I mean, I guess he didn't really help us. Uh, well, that's it. That's that's that game. It's about a cat who does everything to save their human and then leaves them behind and runs away with the dog, who's clearly the real victim here. We learned something. There was a lesson there somewhere. Do I know where that lesson is? Nope. <laughs> Yeah, there's no, there's no post credits. There you go. That's Gato Roboto. I told you we'd finish it. All right. That was just because last stream we didn't finish the game we were supposed to play. We're going to be getting into the real shit. The real shit here in a second. We're going to be doing... Our, our full on community challenge, the one that you guys raised all those beautiful walnut points for. We're gonna begin our torch only run of Bloodborne. Uh, while I'm changing my OBS over. So. Alright, there we go. Let, yep, yep, up, 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 titles updated. Okay, so you might be asking yourself, Walnut, what is what does torch only mean? What what horrible thing have we all signed up for? So torch only is is exactly what it sounds like. I'm not going to deal damage to Bubkiss if it don't involve that torchy torch. Um, as far as weapon wise. We're going to be able to use items, we're going to be able to heal, all that good stuff. I'm going to wear armor, I'm going to level up, I'm going to upgrade my shit. That, that all's, that all's happening, because this isn't, this isn't horrible, horrible masochist mode, you know. But, that's it. I, I don't got no gun, I don't got no trick weapon. We're going to walk up, straight up, we're going to look all the bosses dead in their fucking soulless bodies, and we're going to poke them to death with a torch. I haven't done this before. I've seen other people do it. It's difficult. I don't know if we're going to beat it. I don't know if we're going to do everything DLC included. But god damn it, we're going to find out. So, I'm going to hit you guys with a quick be right back uh, screen. I can't speak today. Uh, while I hook up my capture card and everything. Because Bloodborne is only on the PlayStation. So, uh, stick with it. We about ready to get into it, and I know it's going to be a lot of fun once we get started, so hold on tight and we'll bring you that sweet, sweet, painful content I know you want to see.
Okay, that took me longer than I thought it would because Elgato was not having it. But it's working now. It's working now. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do this shit. Let's get this shit up and running. But yeah. Torch only Bloodborne. Uh, we're gonna play fucking offline. Get the game up for you guys. Boom. Fix this. Eh. I'm actually really excited to to play this game on stream. I fucking love Bloodborne. It's like one of my favorite games. Such a good game. Such a good game and I'm so glad to get to play it. I've been Jones and, and doing something new with it like this. 10 out of 10. I'm here for it. All right, let's just fucking do a new game. Oh, yeah. Pale blood. A pale blood? That's us. Well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mystery. I've got... I've got weak ankles. What can your blood ministry do for my weak ankles? Easy. With a bit of yarn and blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. Alright, we're gonna make the most horrible monster we can possible. Uh, we're gonna make him old. Because the aged voice is best voice. Um. Yeah, let's, uh. Let's see. We. We're gonna want a lot of arcane. If we're gonna be, uh. Doing what we're doing. Um. We don't really need much else. We're gonna get stamina, so we need, you know, endurance. We're gonna need vitality. And we're gonna need arcane. And that's about fucking it, to be honest. Uh, I think milk toast isn't good because it's got too much across. Lone survivor ain't good. Troubled childhood is really not good. Violent past is not good. This one's not good. That one's not good. Not good. Waste of skin. I feel like would be too hard to start. We're just gonna have to start Cruel Fate, because then we have enough arcane to make the torch do some damage, I think, early on. Yeah, we can we can go into that. Yes. The old guy screams are the best part of this game. <laughs> it's perfect. Aged voice. Uh, we're gonna be... Just very burly. Our guy is just gonna be jacked. We're gonna... We're, we're the Giga Chad here. Uh, we're gonna have... I guess a big head. I guess we're at max everything already. Just a, a large man. Oh, look at how pruney he is. Let's get that zoom out. Let's look at his sad man titties. This is his muscular physique as an old man. Beautiful. Can we make him like... I guess we don't have to make him old. We can make him look young. Oh, maybe mature so he doesn't look so baby. Uh, da, da, da. Let's start doing his face. Give him a little age. Make him a little bit daddy. He's got a fucking masculine face. He's got strong form. 
beautiful Ichabod Crane Man titties going on. Uh, he, let's see, he needs... No forehead depth. I have no idea what half these mean. But we're just gonna give our guy like a five head. Yes, he fights with Torch. <laughs> he he kind of looks like Sheldon Cooper. He's just gonna bazinga all the bosses to death. <laughs> I don't know, he kind of looks, he looks really fucking, like he just kind of walks into your house and he's like, oh, oh, this is where you live. This is how you live. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, he can blink through his eyeballs. He looks like a gecko man. And I'm here for it. You know what? Screw it. Let's just give him like the worst eyeballs possible. <laughs> oh no, they gotta be Sid the Sloth far levels out. <laughs> you can see his eyeballs from behind him. That's exactly, that's exactly what you need. He can see all of the boss moves before they hit him. We're just making Benedict Cumberbatch. Beautiful little little elf nose there. Oh no, we're gonna make Morbius. <laughs> That's what we're doing. We're gonna make Morbius. You wanted Bloodborne, but what you got was Morbius. The nose is perfect. I don't need to fix anything else. Give him a little bit of cheekbone. Perfect. Beautiful. Exquisite. Give me that smile, Morbius. I need Morbius. Make him a little thick, a little less thick. Wonderful. Perfect. Perfection. Well, pursed lips. What it was open. No, he needs. He needs little mwah, little mwah lips. Uh, is Morbius happy? No, Morbius is sad because of his backstory. There we go. Needs nice full lips. Yes. Uh, he needs large lips. Not that large. Thick lips. Wonderful. Wonderful. He's beautiful. It's my child. Mouth chin distance. No, I think right there. Or can we get more narrow? <laughs> I love it. This thing's so fucked. Uh little worse. Right there. Large chin? Slight chin? Chinny chin chin? Chin chin cherie? Oh, I never changed my game over. That's... Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I'm dumb. Let's change the game over. 
That's important. Okay, yeah, we got a horrible monster. We got the right game on stream now. I think the chin's fine, honestly. I don't even know, does he have a jaw? Or does he just have a chin? Okay, so we need to get a skin and to make it just light. Uh, what would white be? That almost makes him look kind of human, we need. I guess it would be all in the center would be the widest. Wonderful. Give him some nice dark red lipstick. Mmm. Morbius. Eye area. Light. Light. Or do we do dark? No, we do light. Whatever is the palest, lightest thing. That's how you know it's good. Uh, okay. Give him his hair. Gotta zoom back out. Give him some nice... Nice Morbius hair here. I don't even know what he looks like. I haven't seen the movie. What does he look like? got like long guy hair like stereotypical long guy hair but it's it's side parted on each side perfect that's it that's actually it that's the exact morbius haircut that we need um and he's got kind of a beard <laughs> i like that mustache though he's got like Yes. Boom. Uh, the rest is fine. It needs to be, like, red. Okay. Well, what do glasses look like? <laughs> his, his glasses fit his dumb eyes! <laughs> like, they're cool guy alien specs. Oh, yes. Oh. Have I told you about the books I've published? Oh. <laughs> no, he doesn't have glasses. All right. Okay. More us. Okay, we're a mature Morbius. Nut. nut. Captain! Ahoy, show me your nuts. Captain, you missed the best part of the stream. Thank you for the raid, I appreciate it. But we made our character. Welcome in, everybody. This is my torch only run through of Bloodborne. I'm wearing my glasses so that I can see. And we've made our character Morbius. Let me show you Morbius. This is Morbius. I've spent 20 minutes making him look just like he does in the movies. This is diabolical. This is Morbius. People wanted more Morbius, and I've given it to them. This is what people want. Morbius. So we're gonna 
we're gonna do this we're starting from the beginning we've just we've just made it we've made morbius he's here now he exists and we're gonna fucking go we're gonna have to all signed and sealed all signed and sealed morbius shipping out morbius is leaving beta <laughs> Morbius. <laughs> happens, you may think it all a mere so torch only run no no gun no weapons we can use items we can heal we're doing all that shit but the thing is we we, we don't start with a weapon and even if we die here and we go to the hunter's dream and we can pick up weapons it doesn't mean shit it looks like a frog just like all the innocents you killed? No, he looks like Jared Leto in Morbius. I don't know what you're talking about. He looks nothing like a frog. He looks just like Jared Leto. <laughs> We're gonna get through this. I have... I'm gonna make a beeline straight to the first torch. Once we have the first torch, we're gonna fight the Cleric Beast. And basically, I have... Jared Leto, what the fuck? You had no idea Morbius existed, dude? Honestly, are you even cultured if you didn't know Morbius existed? <laughs> don't, actually don't see it. Memes aside, it was a horrible movie. Uh, but yeah, uh, I, I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty confident that we can actually do this torch run through. What I'm not confident about are two bosses. Unfortunately, they are the second and the third boss of the game. Uh, Father Gascoin and the Blood Starved Beast are gonna clap my cheeks so fucking hard. Um, but once we get past them, we can pick up the Hunter's Torch, which is a torch we can actually upgrade. Uh, and then shit will be Liddy. Oh my god, Morbius. Just like the movie. Jared <laughs> I'm the Joker baby. Oh, whoa. There we go. Um It's also going to take me like 2 seconds to like reorient from Elden Ring back to Bloodborne. But it shouldn't it shouldn't be that bad. I can't I can't physically harm you, Mr. Wolf. I do not have a torch yet. Oh god. Oh god, no. It's not it's not triangle, it's X. Oh, I didn't even need those. Oh god! No, no, no! X, not triangle. Mr. Mr. Wolf, I don't care. Mr. Wolf, I don't care. I don't give a shit about you, Mr. Wolf. I can't harm you. It's illegal. It's illegal to harm without my weapon of choice. And up we go. Goodbye, wolf. Hello, cleric beast. And pop this bad boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hunter's dream. We're going to pick up all the items we can along the way. Uh, and we're just going to not punch anything. Because that's illegal till we have a torch. But yeah, this is going to be the run. This is going to be the run. We're going to do it. We're going to do everything. It's going to be the best. We're going to enjoy this 30 frames per second gameplay because they won't remaster this game. And I don't claim to be a Bloodborne god or anything, but I do like to think that I'm better than the average bear at it. Alright, Torch is actually right here. They they are just begging people to do it. Best weapon in the game, here we go. Uh it's actually a left hand weapon. Okay. Now we can Now we can fight. We got one move. And it's this. <laughs> We gotta beat everything in the game. Uh, let's just fucking do it. We can't... 
the thing in Bloodborne is you can't level up until you have insight. Oh, I forgot about the just sheer number of people up here. Um, so we're just gonna have to deal with the fact that we can't level up. Oh, fuck. Death number one! <laughs> oh yes, thank you so much for the support, guys. I know it's just a podcast. Oh no, your podcast is fun. You guys... You guys have a good time talking about random bullshit, and I'm here for it. But yeah, we need to get that... We need to get that... Sweet... Oh, Captain, if you're gonna be playing the Berserk theme every time we die, you're gonna be playing it a lot. The first death indeed. Drink deeply of the death. We just need to get to... Uh, the cleric beast so we get insight because we see the beast and now we understand we get we get a single eyeball on the inside of our head and then uh and then yeah we can level up pump arcane and such see they got they got all this stuff here for us hey gearman what's up uh, well, could I... oh oh yeah Okay, this was once a safe haven for hunters, yeah. Okay. Fuck you, old man. The future's now. <laughs> we don't hunt beasts, we burn them. I'm not even gonna pick up your shit. Actually, I will pick it up because I can sell it. If I don't accept the gift from the messengers, does it stay here? Mm. That's what we'll do. We'll leave it there and then we'll sell it. We're gonna sell literally every weapon. Everything just fuels our ability to use torches better. We also might do a little bit of early grinding, just to get blood vials when they're cheap, because I have a feeling we're not gonna want to farm for them later. Alright, let's see how much damage this bad boy actually does. I mean, it's not horrible. Yeah, see, you can kill things with the torch. This'll be easy. <laughs> This'll be easy. Um, other noticeable bad things about using the torch as your primary weapon is you can't rally off of it, so that whole really great mechanic in Bloodborne where you heal when you hit people when you're missing health, you just can't do. Ah! Got him! Hello! Subscribers! Whoa! Oh my god, thank you for all those gifts! Cap'n! Thank you for all them gift subs! Means a lot. Means a lot for all the suffering I'm gonna go through. Oh, it's a torch fight! This guy know what's up! Just a couple plague-ridden rats duking it out torch style. You're not wanted here. Get out of here. This is a community event we gotta get involved. I appreciate it. Okay, but no, really. We do need to just sort of run past all these guys because it is not worth fighting all of them. We're just gonna run. We're just gonna run. We're just gonna run. We're gonna get our stamina back. We're gonna run. And then when we're tired of running, we're gonna run some more. And we're gonna remember that circle is dodge. Because we weren't using the right button to dodge before. Give me that shortcut. Don't touch me! We gotta run! Werewolves! Oh no! That's the spot! No! 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 Fuck off! Fuck off! <laughs> Easy. Game is easy. Game is for babies. Society! Oh, 
Get back! Back! Back, you beast! Away! <laughs> Why are you bleeding if I'm hitting you with this torch? Away yourself! I can do that too! You ain't special! Also, Bloodborne has the best corpse ragdoll physics of any game. Just saying. They're like, made out of Play-Doh and I love it. Alright, we'll heal by going to the Hunter's Dream. And then, yeah, we're just gonna have to fucking do it. We're just gonna have to run straight up to the, uh... Uh, the fucking... Uh, Cleric Beast and just... Attempt. The good news is on first attempt of the Cleric Beast, we will have insight, so we'll be able to start leveling up and we can level up our health pool and our stamina pool and our arcane. Uh, so it's not the worst. This is also a good place to farm for blood vials because those big guys drop them down there. But I honestly just need to see how fucked attempting to fight him is gonna be before we even worry about farming up the blood vials that we'll need you see him right up there he's gonna jump he's gonna jump that gate he's gonna jump that gate like a good boy We do so much damage. This is so wonderful. Hmm. Oh, we're gonna need to grind. But this'll this is fine. This is fine. Listen, you got fuzzy legs, you got cheap ass grab moves. I'm glitching in the wall. Everything's cool. Oh yeah, I got stuck on the statue. Classic move. Hello, Nehu game. Hello. Welcome in. We are doing our sweet, sweet community goal of a torch-only run of Bloodborne. Why? Because we said we would do it. And we ain't no quitter. We're playing as Morbius. Can I two-hand the torch? Probably not. We got a sweet karate chop, though. Okay, so now we can... Uh, this one sells for more. This one sells for more. Okay. Is Bloodborne the direct story of Dark Souls? Uh, it's made by the people who made Dark Souls, but it is, it's not related in any real way. Alright, we're gonna sell this. We're gonna sell this. Okay. Hello, good, Hello, good hunter. hunter. You're my doll. I'm gonna give you my monies so that I can do better. Very well. Let me stand. Okay, so. Let's actually, let's do some math here. Let's do some math here. What do you, you got a D rank scaling. So we're not going to get a lot of investment leveling that. We should just level our health. BRB, you'll be listening. I appreciate the lurk. 
Very well, Nedden. Um. Yeah, honestly, we're just gonna raise our health. Farewell, mate. Okay, we're gonna raise our health. Now we're gonna farm. We're gonna try to get like 15 health. I know that sounds like the worst, but it's just what we're gonna have to do. Get that 15 health, get that 15 stamina so we can get some extra torch pokes in and try to get 15 arcane. And just, yeah, do our fucking best, man. These little enemies are gonna be super lethal. The one fun thing about Dark Souls when it comes to these dumb runs is you can two-hand most weapons. So you can squeeze out just an inkling more damage. Bloodborne don't got that shit. You gotta suffer. I really need to see if we can kill these guys. Keep hitting the wrong button for dodging. I need to remember that not all games have the same dodge button. We're gonna poke you! Oh god, you got your friend. Come on, bitch. Oh, oh he got us. <laughs> uh, we might just have to struggle bust it out. Maybe? I don't know, I've never done this before. I should have done any amount of research into it, but I just felt like it was possible, and I'm sure it is. I'm sure it's absolutely possible. I feel like I'm in the tank so hard just for a normal torch mob. Alright, let's do some math here. We'll do some quick math. Listen to the game, but I'm playing really wanted to play a game tonight. No, you're good. You're good. I appreciate you listening. We got one, two, three, four, five hits no dodge. So we brought one, two, three, four, dodge. Can we do two dodges after the four? One, two, oh, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got one, two, three, four, dodge, dodge, yeah. Four, four and then two dodges. We're gonna have to try our best. We're just gonna have to try our fucking best. And get a lot of free heals. I mean, we could run around and pick up items too. That might help out. Get a couple, couple Molotovs or something. Did I want to come all the way back here? I don't think that I did. What's that guy worth? 200? Oh, and what did he drop his items? Blood vials. Oh, fuck yeah. Hold up. Is this the farm? Is this what we're doing? I think this is what we're doing. We're gonna keep killing this this lame wolf. We're gonna keep killing this lame wolf. Mm. 
until we can get any sort of inkling of a of a foothold here. We'll need to do this a fuck ton times. If we're only getting like 300, not even. It's like 800 to level up. The other thing too is I don't know, does this wolf respawn? No, the sick wolf does not respawn. So unfortunately we're not going to be able to abuse that. Fair enough. We'll get all of our freebies, because God knows we're going to need them. Two, three, four. Oh, those sound files overlapping. That's funky. Come on, mate! 1v1 me with that torch. I mean, this thing's got a lot of stagger, which is nice. This, town's finished. this town is finished. Because you got a real man coming to town. Torch and all. And you can't handle Morbius. You need to back off, man. Perfect. Is there an item back here? Molotovs. Absolutely needed. Absolutely needed. We're going to need those in a second. That's our secret tool for later. These fucking suspenders are so comically wide. Why are our suspenders so wide? I don't know. Okay, we're just gonna go through. Do you give us items? If we talk to you? Alright, no, you don't give us anything right now. Alright, bitch. I'm gonna fist fight you. And by fist fight you, I mean use this here glowy stick. Alright. Come here, you son of a bitch! And then this guy's the worst, because he has a shield. How is it my fault? Listen, mate. It's a torch fight. Don't use the shield like some sort of coward. Oh my god, we actually walked into that. Okay, those guys should be passed. We can open this up. Oh, that's right. We use a lever to open it up. Wonderful. Uh, we definitely can't beat that guy. Do you have an item around you? No, this is just oh, a boss, mini boss type deal. All right, we're not gonna not gonna fuck with you. All right, you diagro. You going back to your sad little corner? You gonna leave Morbius alone? Yeah, that's right, bitch. That's what I thought. That's what I thought.
Molotovs again, very important. We're gonna need those. Oh fuck, you actually shot me. Let's heal. Let's just heal. Beautiful. Oh god, more than one dude. Oh god, it's a mob of them. Oh lord, nope. We probably can't do more than 1v1. So we're not even gonna fucking try. I can't stress this enough. I cannot stress this enough. As soon as we get to old Yarnum and we get that sweet hunter's torch, things will make sense. But until then, it's just straight struggle bus. Alright, how much do I need to level up? Oh, I'm what is very But a desire is to know how much I need to level up. We need like two hundred more. This is gonna be rough, but I'm gonna persevere. We're gonna do this shit. All these load screens, truly spoiled. By how smooth Elden Ring runs. All right, come up here. Oh, you got me with that torch move. I see you, cheeky bastard. What do we got? How much does that guy give us? 48. Not a lot. Should be a... A gun guy down here, too, that we can kill. This guy thinking he's hot shit because he's got a cool sword. Like, swords are even as cool as torches, please. Just put, put him in the corner. We're gonna need that pungent blood for sure. We can probably sell the quicksilver bullets too, because we're not gonna use them. It is a curse. Everything's cursed. Oh, fuck you. Actually hit me like some sort of NPC or something. All right, got him. Guy over here. Just waiting the enemies out and then slowly just murdering them with the torch. Well, you're not wanted here either. Firebonk challenge? Oh, you know it. We're, uh, we, we got the torch. We're playing as Morbius. Beautiful Morbius, we got the torch. Um, we're, uh, we're trying to inkle out as many upgrades as we possibly can to fight the Cleric Beast. 
essentially this run is super hard at the beginning because we have to get through cleric beast yeah you're gonna need them oh we need them for sure but we have to get through uh Hunter. cleric beast and gas coin Very well. uh with the shitty torch before we get the good torch Because once we get to old Yarnum, we at least get good torch. Very well. What are you? Old Hunter Bell already. Okay. Uh, da -da 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 -da. How much? Gotta get that thick torch? Yeah, we need the thick torch. I need the thick torch like yesterday. Honestly, we should just fucking... Welcome. What is it? We should just meme it up. Very just go straight to Cleric Beast. Beast. Let's just fucking do it. We got... We got two upgrades in us. We've got... Probably like, I don't know, a hundred more health than we used to. It's just gonna take a fucking... Year to beat the Cleric Beast. You got this? I don't know. They're like, listen. I fully well can be here all stream on Cleric Beast. That just might be the reality of this shit. This this goes from like a like an actual like challenge run to a meme run real quick uh, if you can actually get past Gascoin. Um, but uh, I honestly have no idea if I'm gonna be able to to do this. I just thought it'd be interesting to see if I could. Don't you hit me! Oh, we should have sold our bullets. We don't need them. I don't burn bullets. All right, bitch. Starting spicy, I see. What's this item? Oh no! We got baited for bullets that we don't even use! I'm not gonna use any health potions. This is just to test the waters. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Father Gascoin is definitely the issue. Um, I have no plan for him, to be honest. Uh, it's just gonna be, uh, it's just gonna be my fucking best. <laughs> but if we beat him and we can get to old Yarnum, we can, we can get the fucking Hunter's Torch. And, uh, yeah, that, that Hunter's Torch, uh, actually scales with Arcane. Uh, and then we'll do, we'll do the damage of a dry noodle instead of a wet noodle. All right, let's fucking do this, bitch. Oh, fuck. <laughs> he already screams a lot. But he screams more every time you hit him with fire damage. Hit him with the torch, that's the best advice I can get. Be better and win. Yeah, I mean, we could also try oil urns, to be honest. Like, we could actually walk around the area, find oil urns, and like, make him covered in oil, and we can do maybe like 100 damage off of a poke. Um, I don't know. Like I said, I could have researched this a bit, a bit, a bit better, but I didn't. I Is that an item? Oh, I need that for sure. We can just walk around and get more items. Like that also is uh, an option. I 
I also don't know if I'm gonna try. I guess it's ambitious to, to even talk about this. Why does the torch insta kill these dogs? I guess because they're in the cage. Can I fight Dark Souls dog with torch? Not very fucking well. Oh my god. War! <laughs> Beautiful. Oh yeah, the other thing too is we can't rally with the torch, so all that cool bloodborne healing mechanic goes out the fucking window. I'm in your IP address, dog! Okay, that dog, dogs are not that bad actually. Cold blood's big. We just need to keep getting the cold blood. Fuck you, I'm not a hunter. I don't know any safe places. Don't come looking at me for safe places. Yeah, I think honestly what we'll do is we'll just go around and we'll pick up all the items and sell whatever we can't use and we'll use that to get the early levels. I think that's just gonna honestly be better than us trying to do anything meaningfully with like farming enemies. Oh. Hello, Eileen. Bold hunters, Mark. Bold of you to assume that Morbius needs bold hunter marks. What? Ooh, we can also get the hunter armor, which will help out a little bit too, because we'll we'll have like actual defense. Can I cut this with a torch? Holy shit, we can. Game logic. My immersion is intact and has never been stronger. What do we got here? Because one of those is a weapon, which will sell for like a thousand. It pains me to sell the saw spear because that's like actually a good weapon but we ain't using it make sure there's no other items up here all right ain't nothing else up here so we gotta jump down Oh, those fucking spear guys are gonna diddle us hard. Ah, uh, ha ha, ha ha. Let's well, let's heal. And we're just picking up items. We're gonna do our best not to die. If we die, so well. Not so well. Oh well. Are you the spear? Bless, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money in the bank. Alright, and then we're gonna run. Down this way. Uh, I know all of those are duders going great i got the day off tomorrow oh, bless a day off in the middle of the week is a blessing i ain't fucking with any of you sewer sewer people oh god it's the pig i have no quarrels with you pig wait is, isn't this a pit over here no this way's can I cheese the pig? Oh, I'm gonna milk you for everything you're worth. Back up! Give me those exploitable cheeks, you swine. Come 
Come back. Let me exploit you for monetary gain, swine. <laughs> I'm Morbius. Nothing is below me. Oh my god! <laughs> Listen here, mate. What was that move even? What are you even doing, pig? Come on, piggy, 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 piggy. Pig, 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 piggy. They just have enough of my bullshit. Did you just really de aggro me? The pig was just gonna walk away. The AI was like, wait a minute, I'm being exploited. Listen, just be a good- oh lord. Fuck. That would have been bad. Don't tell me you're running away. Oh, he tricked me! Fight me, pig! Oh no! I'm gonna die to the pig! We killed him, but we're gonna die! Alright, well, we got blood vials now. We might live. You can complain about your phone, though. You and your phone. That was worth so many souls. Wait, this leads to... I don't want to be here right now. That's gas coin. We don't want to go to gas coin. Actually, wait, we do want to go this way. Because we need to run past to get the, the elevator that leads to gas coin. Oh, but we got so many souls. Oh my god, stress. The stress is hitting. We got one shot at this. Okay, we're good. We good, we good, we good. And bloop. See ya bitches! Ha <laughs> ha! Pig. And then we just, uh, need to not get pummeled by the brick dudes. Ooh. Run past this guy. Good. All of that for one level up in health. We're playing the exceptionally long game here, fellas. Very well, let 
Oh, I am... I am a few pennies short, madam. Excuse me. We sell one of my bullets. Welcome. What is it? Very well. Let me st Oh, so much more HP. Okay. We've got the shortcuts unlocked. Um... Mm, let's try to... Let's try to... Try to think this out. Um... Because we know how to get to gas coin now. I mean, we could try his fight. I've got no blood vials, but we could just fucking try. But considering this guy ain't no gas coin and he's clapping my cheeks. That might be a problem. Uh, it's also like 180 to get a vial. Fuck it. Let's just, just let's just try it. What's the worst that can happen? He kills us? Big deal. I die for breakfast. Cause that's just what Morbius does. We could also farm this. Cause he should light a ball. Are you not going to light your ball? I don't remember having to get that close for that to go off. Oh, my controller got wonky there. I want those items. Maybe even enough to die for them. Yeah, it was definitely worth it. Let's get our second insight here. Let's go see Daddy himself. He's just hacking and slapping and slashing that meat. It do be like that sometimes, gas coin. The thing about him, though, is you can kind of get him stuck on the uh, geometry of his boss fight. He's all over the shop. Makes it a little bit easier. Oh no, he's evil! Well, I hit you for eight damage. Oh, the gun's gonna be brutal. Oh my god, the gun is gonna be so fucking brutal, man. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's like actual real life if you try to beat someone with a torch and they have a gun they're just going to shoot you. Oh my god, yeah. And that's not even his final form. I mean when he does final form up, uh we do get the benefit of him being weak to fire damage. So there is that. One of these 
boss has got to be killable. We re actually really need to stop doing this and get that hunter armor like I mentioned at the beginning. I know uh, armor in Bloodborne is mostly cosmetic, but the starter armor is not very protective. Oh my god, camera. <laughs> We're gonna be dying so much. Alright, let's let's have a plan. Let's go into this with a plan. We need to get armor. We need to get blood vials so we can heal. I think if we had 20 blood vials. Like if we actually managed to amount a reasonable amount of blood vials. I think we could give it a, an actual an actual go at it. But let's get the armor first because I know kind of where the armor is. I mean it's been a hot minute since I've played but I do kind of remember. side was the other item on? Oh, you got a gun. There it is. Gimme. Leave me alone, rats. Please don't shoot me on this ladder. Oh, oh lord! Oh god! Oh no, they all have guns! <laughs> they all have so many guns. We're fine. Our resolve is full metal. We're gonna be fine. We just need that sweet armor and we need to find a smart way to farm blood vials. If any of y'all in chat know a good way to get blood vials early, definitely let me know so it's less painful for everybody involved. Listen, gun guy, nobody asked you. Everybody and their guns. What about torches, huh? What about torches? Oh, fuck. Uh. go up. I will soon have something to make a whole uwu stream. A whole uwu stream? I'm very interested in that game. Tell me what your uwu idea is. That's a pebble. I ain't gonna fall for that shit. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Haha, -ha, bitch!
Uh, yeah, I'll find your mother. Give me that music box that I totally need. Thank you. Oh, Jesus, you can climb ladders? Holy fuck! Oh, my God! Back away. Who taught you to climb? Jesus Christ! I had no idea. <laughs> it's a fate worse than death? I don't know. I think oo-woos are just fine as an alternative to death. Ah, oh, the fucking dog. I wanted it. I wanted that item. <laughs> Must burn. <laughs> We all must burn. Away, 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 away yourself. We can also cheese those werewolves up top, like we were with the pig. That actually might be... How people do this, to be honest. This is just going to be farming, I think. I think what we're probably gonna do here is set up our run by cheesing these werewolves. So we're gonna need to kill these two melee guys up here. They don't fuck with us. And then we can lure the werewolves over to this thin door here and prevent them from diddling us. You're not wanted here. Get out of here with that negativity, man. Okay. So clearing all those enemies gives us like 150. Then we got this guy. He doesn't have much health. But he can get through the door. Okay. So now. This is... Come here, good boy, good boy, come here. Good doggy, come on, come on. Oh, fuck! And then I don't think they can come through this door. Oh, my god, but we gotta be actually careful. Staring there menacingly. Just gonna keep smacking you. Keep on smacking.
If one of these manages to weasel its uh, hitbox through the door, I'm gonna shit myself. Oh no! Oh no! I wasn't paying attention! Oh no! <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. All, all my, all my work. Being a degenerate wasted. All my years of degeneracy wasted. Now I gotta kill all these individual guys again. Where are you going, mate? Why are you backing up? He's dead. We gotta do this guy. Listen, I don't make the rules. I need to farm those two wolves. Oh, fuck the last hit. Oh wait, well you have my runes. Or souls, or blood echoes, whatever we're calling it these days. Okay, so that's not that bad. You know, we probably should have just said fuck the health and tried to get the two or three more damage out of this torch that we could have. Probably should have done it that way. Did we though? No. Come down. Come in. Come on. Please tell me that's blood vials. Yes. That's like maybe a hit from a werewolf. I just want one of you guys. Come on. I got a milk bone. I got a tasty milk bone for you. Treaty Wheaties diabetes. Eyes locked from across the room. What if I shake it real nice for you? I think we got one. I mean, we got them both. They're swooping. Bruh. Hit me! Hit me! Okay. I'm baiting you. Get baited. Get baited. Thank you. It's the tug of war of life here. The ebb and flow of battle. Of werewolf and torch. I'd like to keep locking on to him, please. Thank you, game. The risky double torch maneuver. Ah! 
that's what I gotta worry about with stuff like this. Just when the AI decides to think really well for a second. And do a quick hit. Okay. Yeah, that's worth fucking 300. If we can keep killing these guys, we can level up quite a bit. Oh, the quick hit. What are you doing, bitch? What are you doing, bitch? Come on. Oh, fuck the quick hit. We also gotta hope that our souls don't go in one of these werewolves, because if we can't kill them religiously, and all of our souls are in them like a giant werewolf-shaped pinata, I don't know how well this is gonna go. I just don't know. But we're gonna try. We're gonna try our diddly darndest. Uh. Holy shit. Oh my god, no, please. Well, this guy is just trying to, you know, you, you know what? Oh god. Oh god! I was trying not to lose all those souls. <laughs> but we really have to fucking sicko mode this one guy. Okay, let's uh... Let's return to the dream real quick. Bald Raid? Hello there! Hello, hello, hello! Welcome in. Welcome in. I like your little, I like your little raid guy. I like the vibes. Not. Oh, and a follow. Thank you. I don't know why my little, uh, that's weird. I usually, there it is. There, there's the little nut thing coming up. Thank you, thank you. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. I love the dancing guy. That's my vibe right now as I suffer. Yeah, we're playing Bloodborne. Nut. <laughs> nut indeed. We're playing Bloodborne, doing a torch run, because I told people I would. Why? Because I'm sick in the head. And for some reason, even though I knew it would be exceptionally difficult to do so, uh, you know. <laughs> I'm still trying it. So we're, we're, uh, we're past the denial phase, where now we're just slowly farming up uh, werewolves by cheesing them through a door. Uh, and I'm learning exactly how far a torch can reach. And I'm getting a little upset that the NPCs are better at using the torch than I am. But just a little bit. Also, this is our character. His name is Morbius. He's beautiful. Yeah, we're grinding a melee on our first playthrough. Nice, nice, nice. I'm assuming you're playing with real weapons and not torches, like a sane person. Yeah. <laughs> Oh no, oh fuck, oh hold on, hold on. Caught me checking, peeping at my chat, you sly dog. Yeah, Bloodborne, I love Bloodborne so much. It's such a great game. DLC's fantastic. If it's your first playthrough, you're in for a treat. Um, don't do a torch run through. Uh, that's the one bit of wisdom I can give you right now. Um, and I didn't mention it before, but hustle, hustle. Thank you. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Welcome to the nut house. Oh, you bitch. 
You're not wanted here. Oh god, there's a second one. That's right. It's not my fault. I did nothing. What are you talking about? They're just crazy with Beast Plague. Don't mind them. Oh, that was a bad time to lose the lock on. Okay, I really hope that this guy has our souls again. Oh, he doesn't. One of the werewolves has our souls. Come get me. That werewolf doesn't have our souls. Neither werewolf has our souls? Are our souls in here somewhere? Wait. Does the... Does the burn him, burn him real good? Oh, I'm trying to burn him real good. We're gonna burn him real good, real good. Um... Oh, <laughs> yes. Mr. Gun Wheelchair has all of our souls. Don't you shoot that gun! Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God we have, we have power again. All right, uh, how much is it to level up? Oh, that's right, this game doesn't tell you. Get in the corner, I know, <laughs> we gotta shove, we gotta shove wheels in the corner. Uh, I'm not gonna actually try to, to get the werewolf there, uh, just because I don't want to lose the souls. This might be a level up. We've got cold blood we can spend too. The rare opportunities to actually level up. It's exactly what you want. Chick, why, why are you walking away from me, Chick? Welcome, what is it? Very well, let me stand. I mean, for science, we should level up our arcane just to see how much more damage we're going to get out of one level. Oh, I think it was just 350. Can we get two levels? Oh, we got a cold. Oh, no, we can get. We definitely can get two levels here. Okay, we'll start there. Welcome. And we'll upgrade as needed. So we're going to do one level into Arcane, because Arcane scales fire damage. Uh, it didn't actually make us do more damage. So we shouldn't be leveling it. We should be leveling health. Welcome home. What is it? So that was a waste of a level. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool, cool, cool. I mean, it's not a waste of a level. We're going to be using it later. Uh, also, you know, technically, if we raise it high enough, the descaling will catch up with us. But we're just going to try to get to 15 health as quickly as possible. And then we'll get our stamina up. And then it's just going to be farming for blood vials. But that is our life. That's what we've decided to do, and I'm here for it. We can also run and get the hunter's garb to make it a little bit easier. Maybe some oil urns. Tis what it is. Tis what it is, but we're gonna just be smacking these guys around a whole bunch. Holy shit, wait. I forgot about repairing my weapon! Oh no! <laughs> let's... Let's not... <laughs> let's not actually, uh... Let's not actually break the only weapon we can use. Yeah, that would have been bad. Yeah. 
Who knew beating somebody with a stick that is on fire would slowly break down the stick and make it unusable? I sure as hell didn't. I mean, we could try the boss. I keep always wanting to try the boss, but we have no healing. I think that was the one thing I didn't like about Bloodborne coming from other Souls games. Like the dodging's better in Bloodborne, the enemy design is better in Bloodborne. Like a lot of it's just better, but like, it's something I didn't like in Demon Souls too, is having to farm your healing item. I think Estus-like systems are just so much better for these types of games. What do we got in our pockets? We're gonna need that. We got 10 Molotovs. Let's get to the 15 health. We need to stop having our ADHD attacks and try to do 17 things at once. We need to just focus on one thing. We'll get there eventually. Rome was not built in a day, and I'm not an elite enough gamer to beat a boss, probably, without some grinding. Sweet. Do I just kill... I guess I just kill you. Is it ableist if I don't try to kill him? I guess the bullets sell for 30 each. Completely agree, I was saying that before. <laughs> about the needing to, needing to grind or about being not ableist <laughs> by getting the wheelchair guy. <laughs> Hunters, hunters, there's plenty of me to go around. What are you doing? Got multiple people. Oh fuck, this is where I die. Is this because I killed the wheelchair guy? I was torn about it. I think that's what he would have wanted. It makes him feel like he can do anything. also been leveling stamina so we can do more torch pushes in a row but health makes me feel safe so that's what we've been doing okay health makes me feel safe that's what we'll continue to do Fight me, you coward. Okay. Finally got all these guys. You there. Wolfy, wolfy, wolf. Oh shit, he's too. He had no reservations. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't like having the two wolves here, but there's absolutely nothing I can do about it, so we're just gonna deal.
Let's try not to die. How about that, Hunter? How about we just not die, Hunter? It'd be super great to just, you know, not die. And get all the lovely, lovely blood echoes. quick bite the most illegal move what are you gonna do you gonna attack then you're gonna get booped in the snoot with a torch again oh I'm a sucker for that quick bite I get hit with it every time I mean, if you're interested in playing Bloodborne and you haven't, uh, it's actually, I think, probably the easiest of the Souls games. Um, ah, fuck that. Um, what makes it easy is how effective, uh, damage types are against enemies. Like, there's just huge damage bonuses for picking the right, uh, weapon for what you're fighting. And they never, like, outright say it, because you can't really check individual enemies' weaknesses. Um, but it's, like, one of those things that's hinted in the background of the game. Uh, and just in, like, item descriptions and stuff. But, like, if you're fighting something that's a beast, right, using fire or a serrated weapon is really good, because they're weak to getting bled, and they're weak to getting burnt. Uh, and so, if you want to have a really fun Bloodborne experience, but maybe you're a little nervous about playing the game, uh, start with the Saw Cleaver, the default weapon that's on the cover. Just go with that. Slaps. You can, you can beat, you can beat the first boss level one with that thing. It's so good. Honestly, you can use the saw cleaver even at the end of the game, too. It's just really all around solid. I mean, there's cooler weapons for sure, and there's weapons that do more damage, but it's just, it's just a very satisfying, you know, experience. Especially early on, fighting Cleric Beast with the saw cleaver. So good. Let's try to aggro. Okay, definitely aggro you. Because you got my money. Alright, let's not die die though. Let's get our souls back. Yeah, I'm a foul beast, all right. I'm a torch beast. I get that. That should be enough for a level with cold blood. So let's go back. Get that 15 health. Get that sweet 15 health. Everything that we need. Because let's see, you need what we need like 13 Very well. something. 16 something. Still can meet it. Still can meet it with one of these. Farewell. 
Oh, I was in a menu. That's why I couldn't use it. That's why I couldn't use it. Welcome. What is it, you? Very let. Okay, so let's do. Oh, I'm like, <laughs> I'm too short. Are you kidding me? We can also sell all of these because we just can't actually use it. Welcome. What is it? Very well. Let me stand close. And then we can buy buy some blood vials. Okay, so now we've got more health. Like a decent amount of health. Which is nice. So there's that. I think... I think... We can give Cleric Beast probably another try. I think if we throw some... Molotovs at him and use our blood vials sparingly, we might be able to get a little bit better. Maybe. I don't know, but we can try. Okay, let's see. Cleric Beast. Up the stairs? Yep. Up the stairs. That's what we need to do. We'll give it a go. I don't know how well it's going to go. Wonderful. We can also try just throwing one of these and see how much damage it does. I mean, it does a decent amount of damage. But we missed, so that was great. Flick of the wrist bullshit. What are you doing, bitch? I got greedy. Do we use a Molotov? Not a Molotov. We'll use a Blood Vial. We'll use a Molotov. Oh god, we actually got the phase change. Playing footsie. Oh no! My run! Death to the torch lad. Uh, oh my god, we lived. We're not gonna use a healing item though. This run is shot. Oh my god, he got us with a little chip damage there. Death to the torch lad indeed. We're gonna need to do some heavy grinding. Some heavy, heavy, heavy grinding.
but not bad. I mean, we got the phase change off of a torch. It's pretty lit. We could try gas coin again. I actually think I might... I might feel like gas coin's easier than cleric beast with the torch. I know that's kind of weird to say. But like, it's true. He has less health. The gun is a problem. The gun is certainly a problem, but we do- we didn't have the music box when we tried him the first time. Molotov cannon for torch run. Uh, we can throw Molotovs. We just can't use any of the firearms or, um, uh, hunter trick weapons. So we can use any of the items as we see fit. It's just our only, our only weapon is this bad boy. Alright, we'll try gas coin again. Oh, gassy boy. Oh, he's got the Glock! Oh, the fucking gun. God, he can shoot. He can shoot through stone. Oh my God. Let's heal. We just gotta get him out of this first phase. As he drops the gun and tricks out his weapon on phase two. And I think that phase will be the easiest for us. Obviously his third phase. Uh, with the, the beast mode. That's the hardest one. Torture on hype. Thank you. Oh! Alright, gas coin. Come on. Ah! We got stuck. We got stuck. I mean, that's a uh, da, 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 that's not a fourth. That's not a fifth. We probably got like a like an eighth, eighth of his health bar there. Dying hype, dying hype indeed. There's gonna be a lot of dying here. I by no means subscribe to the fact that I'm going to be getting this first time. I'll probably have to do some grinding offline just to even have a fighting chance for most of this stuff. Even just playing through this, though, gives me hope. Epic Sax. Your Epic Sax also gives me hope. Makes me want to play Bloodborne for reals. It's such a good game. 
but I'm going to. I'm going to be at least one boss with this torch, goddammit. I'm gonna do it. I feel it. Morbius will kill Gascoin. I should just send this elevator back up. go and over we go and up we go it's gonna glock us oh god all right last few okay fucking gas coin hold on let's let's see our options here what sort of terrain can we fight this man on that we can absolutely cheese him I'm gonna steal your fucking wife's brooch you piece of shit where is he even alright there he is okay he can still shoot through this one and we can't melee him through it so really, our best option is right here. This is just a really good one, because he mostly can't shoot through it. But it's just long enough that the torch can... can contact him if he swings. to get our free hits in too. He's also humanoid. We might be able to stun lock him. Okay, so we can stun lock him. Hold up. Hold up. We're ler- Oh, he's got a gun. I forgot about that. Okay, we can't stun lock him if he's rolling and we can't stun lock him if he's attacking but if we catch the poor bastard when he's doing neither we can stun lock him get 30 damage instead of the chipping eight i don't know if that's worth it but that's information that is more information than we had at the start and as a wise man named gi joe once said uh, knowing is half the battle. So we can start the fight with the music box, probably get three or four hits in. Then stun lock him, get another three or four hits in. And then we just really got to get him into that second phase where he stops using the gun. Because when we weren't hiding behind tombstones the first time we tried him he just gunned us to death which is never where you want to be just taking damage from across the room you cheeky fucker He didn't get stun locked. I mean, we did 58 damage there. That was pretty good. Alright, I'm popping this. I want to salvage this. Hold on. Yikes. I can't actually hit him at this angle. You need to come over here, gas coin. 
Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, he got the meaty hits. Your fucking gun. No context, walnut pizza or burger. I gotta go with pizza, my man. I gotta go with pizza. Bang, bang goes the coffin nail. We got lots of coffin nails. Ha! Got him! Subscribe for three months. Gimper, hello. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys aren't people of culture. I never claim to be cultured. I'm the smoothest smooth brain. I'm as smooth as they come. You think I'm cultured? Please. The only culture I have is in my yogurt, good sir. You ordered a burger for supper, for what it's worth. <laughs> Does that mean that Gipper has slightly more culture than me? Should we be getting... Hmm. I know I said we need to stop doing the ADD shit, but, uh... Did I tell you the cursed username I used on RS3? No, what was your cursed username? I'm very intrigued. Sewer people, don't you slap my legs. Cultured womb. <laughs> oh. That is a pretty cursed username. Uh, you were not misrepresenting how cursed it was. I know you're all alive, but those bullets sell for a lot of moolah. And that was, that was the worst thing I read in a while. Oh my god. Hold on, I'm trying to remember. How do we even get over there again? We need to cross that bridge. Yes. Then we drop down. Okay. I'm kind of remembering. Use flight. I mean, I can try. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Ooh! He hit me. Don't hit me, Dark Souls dogs. I'm sorry. Don't you do it. Are there items over here? Nope. This is how we do it. We go all sneaky beaky like down here. Uh, oh my god, wait, I didn't notice my health was so low. The folding chair and the fingers. I hate the folding chair and the fingers story. Nixumia, hello! Hello, hello. X to jump? No, no X to jump. You gotta hold dodge to run and then let go of it to jump. Dark Souls games don't believe in jumping. If your legs looked like 
this Morbius's legs, I'd be concerned. <laughs> Listen, Morbius isn't concerned about the petty comings and goings of mortals. He's ascended past that. Wait. Which way was the armor? I'm just gonna have to run past you. Is it all the way down this way? I thinks, I thinks. Oh, well, I missed. I got good armor now. Suck a dick. I'm away. Hello, rats. Whoop, whoop. Oh, there's no item back here, is there? I may have cornered myself. Hey, Mr. Weird Looking Wolf Thing, it'd be great if you didn't. Oh, fuck. Oh, they're eating me alive! Yeah, this was the sailor area. Enjoy the sound, the cacophony of like 18 giant rats eating my corpse. Sorry, I've been antisocial. You, you're not antisocial. I just appreciate that you're here right now, watching me suffer. But we do get, we get the drip now, though. I can show you Morbius's face. Honestly, we shouldn't have even had the hood on. We've got that good Morbius drip. Oh, it hides his face, though. How much defense does the hat even really give me? It gives me... It gives me some. <laughs> Loot alert! <laughs> it's you both being rats? How am I being a rat? Tell me this. I guess the only way to know how much less damage we take is to get hit. Hit me. I may mean, take a little less damage. We take a little less damage. I mean, we still suck. Jab. We got one move and it's jab. And then I started jabbing. That's what makes up your dark mist body micro rats. Sailor's exposing my deep seated VTuber lore that I'm just a pile of micro rats. Like the king of rats. Speaking of being made of rats. What do you mean, speaking of being made out of rats? Have you tried Plague Tale yet? I have not tried Plague Tale yet. I guess from your description that it's about a bunch of rats. I don't know what you said, Nyx, because it got bleeped out. Ding dong, the sailor's dead, the wicked rat, the wicked rat. Ding dong, the sailor rat is dead. Assuming it was, uh, sent the sailor. Ah. Away! I away away better than anybody. So we have this chick's mom's brooch.
we might be able to sell it. We might have to crack it open to sell it, though. <laughs> do you want... Do you want a counter for the amount of times the torch enemies say away? Because the amount I'm gonna have to grind here to get my health high enough that I can win these fights is gonna be redonkulous. vials don't you shoot that gun he's just quoting the Wizard of Oz there's nothing wrong with that it's a classic You're, you're gonna break them? Alright, thank you. My god. Back in my day, AIs would break their barrels right away. They wouldn't do no hanky-panky BS of running into them straight on for a few seconds. Back in my day, NPCs had integrity. phone is revolting. Are you telling me to eat dong? Is this a go? Why do I feel like this is just alluding back to all those old really bad expand dong memes from like 2014? Ding dong captain can't write his own songs. <laughs> Why you gotta do them like that? He made a deep cut reference. We can appreciate that. I almost feel bad when they scream, oh God, as you light them on fire. Um, Senor Wolf. Here, buddy, 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 here, buddy, buddy, hey, buddy, 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 woo. Let me cheese you for a monetary gain. I gotta keep poking them. Called you a rat. He calls you a rat every day. You should be numb to it at this point. I mean, we've been playing this now for almost three hours. And all we've managed to do was level up five times and get some drip. So all in all, I think it's been a pretty successful stream. That's the thriving soldier's life, land and country, there your wife, and the long road at your door. I really thought you were going to make a dong reference by now in your song. <laughs> oh god! I was watching chat, you werewolf bast- Oh lord, he's got- he's got the spicy quick slaps. If it wasn't for the fact that your blood was worth so much, Werewolf, I wouldn't even be pissing you off right now. Okay. Gimme. Oh, greed. Wasn't worth it. It's my popular belief it was deaf American Psycho. Back to the shadows, much love. 
Thanks for the love. Thank you for the lurk. I appreciate both. It's a song they sing in the first Witcher game. It's been like years since I played the first Witcher game. That's a thriving soldier's life, land, and country. Air your life in the long road at your door. That's it. Sounds kind of familiar, but like I could very well be remembering any of a thousand songs that might have some semblance of those words in it. Don't you bite me! Don't you bite me! What are we doing here? What are we doing? We just doing the tango? We just doing this lovely dance, me and you, Mr. Wolf? Oh god, I shouldn't have been greedy and go for two. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Bop! Bop! Oh, fuck! Bop! Aw. Bop! Quep! Oh, oh, did I just get double hit there? Oh my god, we... Oh, he was a ghost wolf. <laughs> Away, aka Lurk, gotta go get the food. You get that food. Enjoy that food. Consume that food. Well, we got a lot of bullets to sell. We got cold blood. We can probably level up stamina now. Start up that process. If only, if only, the woodpecker sighs, the bark on the trees was as soft as the skies. As the wolf waits below, hungry and lonely, he cries to the moon, if only, if only. What the hell are you talking about, Captain? I sure do hope this is enough. Welcome. What is it you did? Very well. Let me. It was enough. Can I get six hits now? Kind of. I'm just stealing songs from movies. That's fine. We all steal songs from movies. So we can't dodge after the the fifth. But we can like soft get a sixth one in. Yeah, we definitely need to up upgrade our our stamina. Uh we should also What's our durability at? Yeah, it's at half. Let's let's repair that. Let's just repair that real quick. All right. I mean, cleric beast. We could try cleric beast. I think what I'm gonna do here is we'll do like a couple more runs trying to get the Cleric Beast and we'll get it or we won't and then if we don't offline I'll go through the grueling parts unless you guys really want to watch me lose my sanity slowly farming the same mobs over and over and over and over again um but I'll level up and then I'll beat the bosses on stream I think because again this run is super boring in the beginning because you just have to kind of 
rub your two brain cells together to get past the first two bosses. But then once we get the upgradable torch, we can actually, like, do a torch run, and it's not so bad. There's the phase change. Oh god, nope. This ain't our run. This ain't our run. We got baited. We got baited. Screams. <laughs> I mean, that's that's the cleric beast fight. It's just screaming. <laughs> it's just tons and tons and tons and tons of screaming. Just because I like smacking that guy. All right, fucker. We just <laughs> we're getting slapped around like a pinata need to focus despite how much it's screaming at us and dodge at the right time. This is probably not a good placement for us. Hey, Clark Beast, let's not fight in the, the archway. Let's like, yeah, let's, I'm just walking my dog. Damn, I missed, missed that timing. This sounds like me after drinking dairy. <laughs> <laughs> I 
This this is me after I eat hot wings. <laughs> the cleric beast went mad because they're lactose intolerant. It's not the beast plague. They all simply went to Taco Bell. <laughs> Again, you bastard! Wombo combo. Oh, the wombo combo. We got stuck in a back corner. Rip. Rip, 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 rip. The good thing about the Cleric Beast fight, though, is like the dodging is very intuitive. So, like, I'm not worried about fighting the Cleric Beast as far as that. I know, like, theoretically we could do it if we just calmed down and fought him for, like, ten minutes straight. The Gas Coin fight, I don't really know how I'm gonna do, to be honest. If I tried more damage, uh, I could level up Arcane to get more damage, but it's gonna be multiple levels to see any return on investment and that return that we're gonna see with this torch will be like oh fuck we got grabbed it'll be like one more point of damage which I know is more damage still but we could get like additional uh, pokes by leveling stamina So I'll probably do that first. The stinky grab. <laughs> Cleric Beast with the original stinky grab. Oh, that was... <laughs> that was the stinky grab. That was like the tip of the, the fucking middle finger got us. Ah, <laughs> oh, quick slap. That feel when you ask if for iced tea and they send you root beer. <laughs> I'm here for the cleric beast memes, they give me life. It's just... I don't know, like when a Karen gets told she can't do something at a restaurant. <laughs> That would also be pretty awful. If you're like expecting like some iced tea and you take a fucking swig and it's root beer, you're gonna be in for an experience.
Oh, he almost got grabbed there again. hit with the tail end of that. I just think about stubbing my toe and making these noises, to be honest. <laughs> I've been bamboozled, swindled, made of mockery of. I've been schmeckledorfed, and that's not even a word. What are you doing, mate? Pokemon in his little butt. Oh, we dodged with it instead of against it. Oof. That's not even a word, and I agree with you. I think my brilliant joke was almost missed amidst my anguish. What was your brilliant joke? Did I miss it? Did I miss your brilliant joke? I want to hear it. Is it the I don't even have a... Oh god! Torch guy! Oh lord! Just kill me, I punched you. I liked your joke, and I appreciate it. Thank you for your joke, Gimper. Away! I should change my lurk to away while I play Bloodborne. I love the fucking, the sound, uh, the voice lines that these guys do. Away, foul beast! Away! You're cursed! 
bad blood, bad blood, and all that stuff that they say. It's so fucking dumb. I love it. Oh, yeah, we need to go this way. All right, we'll give this son of a bitch one more good try. Before we, we call it for the evening and I spend my free time tomorrow. Uh, absolutely dumb grinding. Enough with the haymakers, Superman. My god. Giving you hot feet. Oh, this is a horrible spot. see the HP bar this time so that's an improvement yeah I mean what's really frustrating I don't know how many of you have like played or seen Bloodborne get played before but the amount of like hits that we're performing on this boss would be enough to kill the boss with a normal weapon it's it's very weird for me to um to be dodging most of its attacks and not kill it <laughs> it's so I, i'm enjoying myself it's really weird i'm not making any progress but this is very enjoying for me at least because it's like i don't know it's like refining dodging to a point where you're actually learning the encounter instead of just learning how to be as fast as possible damaging during the encounter I don't know how I'm going to beat it, but it's interesting. Well, I mean, I know how I'm going to beat it. We just over-level ourselves to the nines. And grind up 20 health potions just for this one fight. got smacked how will we know you didn't cheat to add souls if you train off screen I mean that's true you wouldn't I mean I can't like 
console command it, because this is... I mean, I can prove it too. Uh, that this is a PS... This is not, like, me playing it on computer. Uh, so I can't, like, console command it. I'd have to actually just grind it out. Uh, but you make a good point. I guess I... I mean, I, I guess I can... I'll leave it up to chat. We'll do a poll when I'm not... Like, at risk of dying here in a second. If you want me to try to grind up off or on stream. Because if I'm grinding on stream, that's all we're going to do. That's all we're going to do. No worries, it's a joke. I mean, truthfully, honestly, let me know. Let me know in chat. Would you want me to grind on stream or not? Lord. Oh, oh Lord, we got the grab. Maybe a pull? Yeah, I was thinking a pull too. Oh, we lived! Bitch, I lived! Alright, I'm dead. Let's do a pull. Let's do a pull. Let's do a new pull. do a quick uh, quick three minute poll here how do you make your poll I already I already made it I already made it I got a button for it but yeah yep yeah, let's uh, let's vote that out I think I think that is where we're gonna stop for the evening on this regardless just because it's getting late. I didn't bring water into my room here, and so I'm a withering plant boy. Oh, woe is me. Withering away because I don't make good decisions. Oh, oh, go. No, please don't. Did I misspell it? <laughs> I misspelled it. It's all right. We 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 know what's up. Oh yeah, no, it was it was totally it was totally Snailer who who made the poll. Yeah, it totally totally wasn't me or anything. Yeah, it was, it was Sailor who can't, can't make that poll. Yeah, it's Sailor's fault. But Sailor's doing a great job. Sailor's doing a great job. Uh, so we're gonna. We're gonna give Sailor a quick shout out. Thanks. Thanks Very for always obvious. being there, Sailor. We're gonna stop at every fucking island on the goddamn way. How you feel about them apples, huh? Hug tackle, Sailor. Very sweet. Very sweet. Yeah, I want. Um, it's I looking like three people, the, uh, for the love of God, don't want to see me grind it out on stream, which is fair. I can respect like that. We got about a minute left. Very um, good, but. Know? We got 11 people here uh definitely thank you all for tuning in uh i'm beating this game i said i would i don't know if i'm going to you want to see more wind waker <laughs> i love wind waker then check out sailor she's going to be streaming tomorrow i don't know if she's going to be playing more wind waker but she's going to be streaming and she plays wind waker nut 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 thank you for the cheer thank you for the cheer gimper i appreciate it is that just a just a little little smeckering of uh of salt? I appreciate it. They're calling you out in chat, sailor. They want Harvest Moon. They want Wind Waker. They want it all, man. You gotta give it, give them what the people want. But uh, yeah, I'll I'll grind it out for you guys. Uh. <laughs> I appreciate the extra little bitty bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
he can't go he can't wait to go back to Wind Waker fantastic fantastic oh god no oh no. god no we got a tie oh no I don't know what that means And <laughs> An ooh woo. Sudden death voting. I guess we can do a sudden death voting. But I gotta do it in ooh woo mode. So let's uh let's do another Let's do another poll. Hello my friends, we doing another poll. Well, my viewers, should I windy windy on stream? You spent 200 points to make it three against? How cruel and unusual punishment! Oh, why, oh, why? <laughs> why would you do that? <laughs> Everyone is suffering now. Woo nuzzles your suffering, notices your suffering from across the womb. Woo. Not. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. All right, we got we got people voting in this bitch. Lots of people voting nah. Lots of lots of nahs in chat. I I respect the nahs in chat. We just need to we just need to get it to a point where we can uh we can do what we want. We can do what we want in the game. And I think that's important, right? If we just if we just power through let me grind through, get the get the resources and everything to actually get the hunter's torch versus the normal torch. I think that's that's gonna be all we really really need there. But yeah, I want to thank each and every one of you fine people for stopping by. It means a lot, even when I'm doing dumb shit, and I'm not even doing dumb shit well. Um what do we got here? Not one, 91%, 91%. So yeah, I'll stream, I'll, oh, it's not stream. I'll grind this out tomorrow so that I can, uh, I can stream it out on Friday. And yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I, I, I want, I want to do the full game torch only. We'll see, we'll see how it goes and what my madness level is, uh, after getting past this first part. But if I can get past this first part, I do think it's just all downhill from there. So, I think you're sorry, Nick's never be sorry. It was all, it was all me. Nah, I appreciate it. If you want to stream it, you should. I, I mean, I don't really care one way or another. I just want to. I just want to make it so that you guys can see more of Bloodborne because I do. I do really like Bloodborne. It's one of my. It's one of my favorite games, like of all time. It's also one of those things too that like I should just stream Bloodborne normally. You know, uh, just do like a normal run through so I can geek out about the game and stuff, but. I think I promised the torch run. I'm gonna give it my best shot. We're gonna try to at least at least beat one boss if I actually suck ass this much with the torch. And regardless, if I can't if I can't get deep in the game with the torch, we'll just uh pop Bloodborne open and do a quick run through just because just hearing the music and playing the game makes me want to finish it out. The torture run. I should I should have named the stream the torture run. That would have been a good idea. That would have been such a good fucking idea. Okay. But let's uh let's get a raid going here. Cause you're all wonderful. Uh 
let's raid out to uh let's raid out to soma because soma is cool who are we raiding we raiding soma antics she's cool and make sure hey make sure listen to me i want i want you all to listen to me this isn't a joking matter you think i'm joking you think i'm joking people but i'm not we're not joking here. This is serious. We're using big walnut face for this. You don't want to listen. I don't care if you want to listen, Captain. I don't care, Captain, if you don't want to listen. Oh, that's my sad face. Where's my angry face? That's my happy face. That's my, that's my mad face. Listen to me. We're serious walnut today. You got to tell her she's cool because she's cool. So tell her she's cool when we raid him. <laughs> Whoa. Sad crash wall. Anyway, thank you all for watching. It means the world to me that you stop by. And I will catch you Friday, where I hopefully have more Bloodborne going on after I've grinded it out. But you're always wonderful. Scary Nut Raid. Let's go, Friday. Goodbye.